everybody heroes of the greeks here thank you for joining me today so we're going to start off with building up the or finishing off the lions enclosure i finally got some lions so that's quite cool although the soul score is a bit too small i was really unfortunate because one of my lions died of dehydration yes so thank you very much for that ah, oh, so annoying but it happened hopefully we can have some zookeepers be assigned to that because I rather would them to have some die again. That would be really annoying. So let's get a new work zone. Um like for all of these. Although they are actually really working, but still you can never be too careful. I'm just going to click all of these I suppose. I'm not too sure. Trade uh, keepers. <coughs> I've been using this one quite a lot as like the main staff buildings and I'm with these somewhere like over overall in the terrain. So this is the new park, uh, I've been building it, it's not really too big, but it's just a small, uh, it's not too detailed I must admit, but I think that is decent. So let's go and send the south end to which zone? Is that? That's this zone, yeah? Alright, that's fine. It's only for the zookeepers though, so it shouldn't be too much of a... Oh, you got to be kidding me. Animal free, which one? How has that happened? Why are they, they so dehydrated? Like, that doesn't make any sense. Is that because they like, um, the meals are just keep. Nay, no, they're, they're just piss because of the pain? Uh, is it the space? Maybe. Oh, it doesn't make too much sense, to be honest, but okay. And send this on to the Bunga Sanctuary Center. Mm, the lion should now be getting some, uh, some some moist, so let's go and send the South Keepers to that appointment. Um, most of the other buildings, though, like this one I've built myself, well, there is nothing special. I must admit that there is nothing special. This is just a small. Uh, enclosure for the lions to hang in, just more than big enough. Over here we got uh, the lions enclosure, uh, the tigers enclosure have now also gotten. And they have been a pain in breeding, they are not really the ones that uh, like to do that too much. That must be admitted, um, they're not really into breeding. Over here we got a warthog enclosure, over here we got campus box, over here we got the para parent Pachhorn antelopes. Uh, do I actually have to switch one of them out because there are two males in here and they are basically fighting with each other trying to gain the dominance over the group. So they're most of the times really getting injured. As you can see they're quite productive in breeding. And over here we got the three rhinos who I'm going to have to uh, switch one of the males out. That's this one. Like their martial max social group is two, so and we're going to sell an extra uh, meal. It is the female, but I would like it. The female's quite old, so I'm not sure if they're going to breed again. Um, she already got two babies, so I'm not sure if that will work out. To be honest, I got actually. Uh, I thought I already put you inside of the enclosure with the other ones. Uh, yeah. Over here as well, we've got a really big enclosure with, um, with buffalo. Seems to be also tortoise. And we actually got a dead one over here. Yeah, I still think of getting this one also, like anywhere else, because I'm not too happy in this one. Uh, we also got some ostriches. Got again some sable antelope. Quite a lot of buffalo. Although I'm not sure that these guns still can breed. I'm not sure, like, I'm. Um, like on their old stage so they're no longer fertile so we're going to put in i think oh i got the other one also in oh well doesn't matter too much and i'm really also watching if i don't have any two males because they seem to be fighting a lot so hopefully they won't do that but it's a good chance on that 
But uh, those ones are the ones I, why I got actually quite a lot and I was able to pay for the West African Lions and the uh, Tigers as well. But yeah, I must admit, I must quite, I was quite a piss that I uh, lost the previous two. Although I must admit, I think this one looks a little bit better. Um, I still have like to change this a bit up, getting up for this. Over here we got an, uh, my own design staff building, nothing special. This is a small staff building people can use. This is a really primitive one. Uh, over here we got some viewed shelters again. Um, yeah, that's no nothing special. Or I was not going for that. I uh, just wanted to uh, place it, build something, build a little bit of a zoo and uh, but get out the hand of the building mechanics like I think I, I, I really like this part although I have not built these ones myself but I do like the uh, surrounding area around it, that's not bad at all but now let's go to the line exhibit we're not going to do anything special but we're just going to make them happy uh, get a little bit of scenery in, see what they can do and um Let's go. Oh, they're already, she's already pregnant. Perfect. Well, Tigers, take an example of your better persons. We're getting uh, some babies. I think one's wrong. I think we're going to do that. A bit like this. I'm surprised we've managed to rock that like once. It's quite a lot. And then some short grass. Stay away from the long grass! <laughs> if you know where that comes from. Possibly not, but... What was the chance? I'm possibly going to do here the sand. Or if you, do we got need soil? No, they actually don't need it. I really like this sand. This sand part is quite nice. I must admit, it's actually not too bad if I can small. The zookeepers, yeah, I still have to want to change this possibly up because it doesn't look too good. I must admit this uh, this edited thing here because they don't seem to go into the enclosure. So let's um, move this one somewhere else, like over here. Hopefully that will work out. And they can uh, start be feeding. Oh, they they actually did replenish this one. They actually get food out of this one. So I suppose that. What the nerf? Huh. Although I must say the line looks not bad. So they do want another line, like necessarily. Um. So. Bombo tree. And that's all that that plan's gone. Done. <laughs> yeah, almost. Like it just like only that tree is almost done at all. <laughs> um. Yeah, I thought so. Because this carab carabo. Ah, yeah. That makes sense. Coastal mangrove, rock wood, some vines, apple. We want some acacia trees. Like I already will. I know. I already want only trees. I don't necessarily want anything else for them. So it's going to be a really easy enclosure, as you can see. There wasn't enough too much designed into it. But I also tell you, I will be changing up my format how I'm going to play the game. Um, at least when it comes out. So I can like uh, do a little better job at it, and also have a bit of better building skill. So um, the series might be so it's not, it's not going to be like this for me. Also, a learning curve for the game. Oh come on! Um, how did you do that? Um, can you actually jump over that? No way. I don't believe that tapirs can jump over that. That doesn't make much sense, and they haven't done it in like never <laughs> before. So I also built this, yeah, a sort of a bracky uh, statue of stones. It was yeah, there were not really more stones, and otherwise it would have been a really big like thing. And I also don't want that. So um, this is really you know, 
not too great, but for the stones that you have, like there are not too many small stones. You cannot really, like, you cannot really make a shape with the stones. I only put some pumpkins into his eyes. <laughs> uh, like that idea a bit more. Yeah, I know. But yeah, this is taper. I think this one actually looks not too bad. Quite, quite vivid. A little bit of a small sleeping paddock where they can sleep in under. Uh, and um, yeah, over here we got this enclosure. Again, really been busy trying to you know, get some nice plants around it. Although I'm just like thinking that I've put needles everywhere. I just like the core of them quite a lot, and they were like quite a small plant uh, for that as well. And then here again, some quite nice foliage to get into the sky gears. Because the tigers actually need like multiple of these when they like get cups. Already got a cup, so these ones, these ones are actually the cups of the previous pair. So I might have to sell the the, the male one and then get a other male one for this one, um, just to make sure. So let's do that at least. Let's go and move them in. Let's go to animals trading. And let's go and sell this one. That's not bad. Three hundred. Like I saw like in the Trenimal trade up and they were really expensive. So I'm not sure why that actually actually is. Like I think you can make the expensive but nine of nine of the times nobody buys them because they're too expensive. So yeah. I'm just going to do this so that there's a more productible price for someone to get it. Um let's also get a big old tiger. That is big old tiger male gone. It's actually quite decent. So let's send the mail away. And for four hundred and fifty. Now, Tiger's a bit more worth, especially the males so most of the time, so... 350. Uh, release into the wild, I'm fine with that. Yeah, th this seems like we're sometimes bugged out quite a lot. Like, you can't sometimes just stop with it, so it doesn't work anymore. So this is the lion's enclosure, we don't need to really do much else. If I'm correct. What the nerf? Are you... Oh! Already got cups. Jesus, you did that quickly. So how many cups do we have? Like we have a oh we've got a golden male lion cup. Two of them actually, so that's really nice. You're dead. Oh no, you're not dead. Good, good, thank you, thank you. Thank you for that. Um habitat. Clean this not too great, but alright. Alright then, so we've got two male lion cups. And he she is getting into this. Not bad. Got some water treatments failing. So again, oh, that was quickly. They got uh, the male lion, I suppose, or the uh, they got the definitely they got the tiger. Not bad. So if I continue, let's go to animal market and we go to um, species and we go to bagel tiger. I'm going to try and get a new male tiger for our female, and we don't have any. Male tigers. Perfect. Aye. Nice. Uh, hmm. like, nobody is going to buy this tiger. Like, no one is going to pay that much for a tiger. Like, these ones are more reasonable. Although I wouldn't buy this one, I would buy this one because this is quite decent. like 400. Uh, what is it? Over here, 400 or something like that. So, what I'm now going to do, because I don't really want the female tiger to become older. Uh, while we wait to be yeah, able to get a male one, I'm just going to put them outside. And as you can see, these guys are breeding like freaking rabbits. Well, let's just get the entire male population gone. And have them sailed away. To distant lands. And have the, the babies repopulate the entire zoo. Because they will. So, that shouldn't be too much of a problem. And these ones also built myself, although there's nothing special of course, but it d does its purpose. And uh, over here as well. Any more meals than we need? Yes we do. Uh, so we've got two meals, there's one. And another one that's not even too expensive, so we get that one away. Perfect. And over here as well, like... Um, we got an old meal now, we got only a meal now, if I'm correct. Or do we still got... we also got a female, but... She's not getting pregnant again, I suppose. 
I've not seen it happen yet, so let's go and try and get a new female one, and then we'll try and possibly sell that one. Let's go to Indian Rhinoceros. I already got some real cool ideas what I want to go and start doing when we got the uh, when we get the fill game. Um, ooh, the seven hundred and fifty though, so that's quite expensive for a female one. Although we still can get yeah, one that does it get up. I'm fine with it. That got quite a lot of fertility for itself, so hopefully we'll be fine. And then we'll sell away the uh, what is this the the female one. Hopefully that will work out. I see he's still got some fertility left. But I hope also well that the male is going to get going. Conversation, like quite high. Not bad. Oh, the female is like... Did I buy this? Oh my god, no. I bought a really old female that's not going to get uh, any more babies, I would say. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> if you, yep. Oh, that is a pro oh, that's such a waste. That's a really sneaky move of them. Ay ay ay. I don't think this going to produce any more babies. Ah damn it. Although this one definitely wouldn't either. But we still can try it, I suppose. Um we can still put her in. But like I should have said, that's some type box out, but it's a bit annoying, but okay. We have to deal with it. Assuming if four dogs you got me. <laughs> like that's so annoying like why does that happen it's like although we got some good female ones so they would be quite decent for sailing some golden ones. Hopefully that will work out as well. So as I said, I'm not going to, I'm going to do speed build, but that will be in the new um, when the game comes out fully with sandbox mode. So you know that as well. Uh, unfortunately, like that has not been in two weeks because in two weeks I got a holiday. So I'm not sure again when the full build will come out. I have to check that, but I'm not sure. I think it's like the 12th of November, right? I'm not too sure on that, but let me know in the comments if you knew it. Interested in knowing that. Now, you're not happy with me doing this. Well, anyway, what is the problem? No whale there. Um. I've not really been putting down any... what is it? Oh, you ever got some frogs? Huh! Suitability? Oh! Oh, I put none of these on. Sorry then. I hope that worked out a bit more. So over here we got... Um, over here we got like one frog. There. Can have a look at them, I suppose. Uh, they're over the camera. Although this one is not so useful. And there we got one over here, and then one in the water over there. So those ones are the ones that we now have new. And again, do we have some more meals than our feet? Uh, Well, it seems that it's fine, um, so let's go with room this. So yeah, the lines are fine, it seems like, so that's more than good for me. Um, 
And what we're going to do is go to again to animal trading, and we're going to put down the wild dogs, I suppose, because we don't really got any other animal. <laughs> like I'm trying to not do all the animals that we've already gotten, but like what what don't we have? Yeah, what do we have in the other zoo that we don't have now? Oh, Indian elephants! I think Indian elephants would be really cool. We got no oh, cook get those. Didn't get any of the um, like um, climbing ones, but um, I rather wouldn't. Um, Hermelian bears would be cool. But I wouldn't mind the Indian uh, elephants, to be honest. All like those. Yeah. Ooh, I saw a really, ex really deep one. But possibly not a good one. Oh, um, that's actually quite decent. Get it, get it. Yeah, nice. That is definitely something I'm going. Oh, we also got some more um, uh, animal salt because we got now some less stuff. We sold the female rhinoceros, hoping that we can get like still one more. And then hoping that we can get a male tiger at some point. Not that. So we're going to now get... Uh, can design his enclosure for his. Let's also go to the terrain. As I said, it's not going to be a real like build how to build stuff. I'm just not good at that yet. And I don't think it is going to be too much enjoyable seeing me struggle. I just do it more with, like, like this, more life. Spill some stuff with it and see how it all goes and plans. I think that's well, uh, something I would like to see more. Come up, get out, you doggy. Uh, that's because of the dog. So get out, dog. Come up, doggy. <gasps> really? Really, dog? You're really just going to do that to me? Come up, get out. Yeah, very good boy. Ready? Nice. Oh. No, what's that? Inbox animal. Alright, so I suppose we're going to try and remove these trees. Let's go to habitat. Ah, it's a much long grass. And not the short, not the short grass. So what we're going to do is go do this. We're going to get all of this away, get all this to normal grass. I'm possibly going to build a uh, small burry for them. I'll play that will be good and nice. Small burrow is what we want. Oh, well, that's actually quite useful. Aye. Oh, that's actually quite nice. With that, we can actually build some cool things. And now we're going to smooth it out. And I already got sort of like a sort of buildy build. Mm. And now we're going to smooth it all out. Just a small bit. But and now we're going to ribble it. Bit a bit. Too great, but at least we're getting some sort of a shape in.
All right. Um. Eh. I'm hoping that I can still gonna sort of more or less walk on it. Oh, I suppose. Get in. Lower this a little bit. Should do you with the hard shelters normally? Yeah, fine. And now we need a little bit more short grass. Nice, perfect. And now let's get some nature in. Um, I want some rocks. Now I'm going to go to buy them. Um, it is only grassland in um, Africa. Grassland, cotton, and Africa. Yeah, it seems like the grasslandy uh, thing is not. Well, at least the continents, they don't really count with um, the rocks. And uh, a little question for anyone who's played Planet Coaster more than me. Or at least has played Planet Coaster or Planet Zoo and knows a little bit of a trick. Like, um. I don't know, but sometimes I like um, I lose this and then I can't move it again. What is like the b best way to do that? Is there another way you can like do that? That would be quite nice. So that would be. Oh God, this thing is. Um. Ooh. There's a little bit of a sort of a side wall. I'm right now almost thinking I should put down the lions in this enclosure and um, the, the, the wolves in the other one. <laughs> if I'm honest, no. Like, what's for that the best option? Like, they can, like, don't really like use very like building yeah. ah well hopefully I know that the zoo keepers can come walk over these things and uh, let's actually do that before they all starve to death let's get some food into the enclosure for the dogs And if you actually want to see where your animals can walk, there is like a way for that. And I suppose if you see these videos, you possibly have seen some different videos. But and uh, the Assassin's Creed videos, those of you are interested in that, I just put that on because I didn't really have to anything else to record it. So this uh, this video should come out on Thursday. Because uh, on that day, I just don't have any time to record something different. Hey, then go for here, and then you can see, uh, what is it, habitat, and this done the walkable areas for your animals. So the wild dogs can also get into here, so that's quite cool. Uh, as well, uh, let's go to habitat again, and I hope 
that we can get some ghoul things for the wild dogs. Species, um, or this African wild dogs, yes. Yeah. Enrichment. No food enrichments though, but fine. And let you get some um, nice nature in for them. Right, we get plans. Like it seems like for this, but when you place it down, it, it doesn't um, isn't for them meant for them actually. So it's quite interesting. Oh, uh, I don't actually have it uh, on my. Paparis. And I'm possibly sure that these ones are not meant for the wild dogs. But, well, doesn't matter, it looks nice. Inside the water. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh my god, what an annoying noise. <laughs> Oh lord. Oh, I really hope like in the main game you can have, uh, what is it? You don't need necessary, uh, there's no requirements what they want in their uh, enclosures. That would be really nice. I'm surprised also at how few African, um, uh, plans there actually are for grassland. It's quite surprising. I would expect there would be far more, but no, actually no. And I'm not sure if they're actually like, already fed up with their entire enclosure with their plans. I think they might be. No, they're actually not. They're fine with it. So that's definitely fine. And they actually like the papyrus, so that's good. No, actually, the enclosure doesn't actually look too bad. If you look at it like this, so that's not bad. But a nice case system for them. And uh, over here we got the lions, who I'm not sure if already are old. Nine year old now. Oh yeah, we got the animal sale, so let's go and get the animal market and hopefully get a decent bagel tiger price for a meal. And that should be golden. Uh -huh. uh, should we roll with that one? I think we should roll with that one. Animal market. Let's go there again. Uh, I suppose animal storage, sorry. And let's go to the big old tiger. Female. Hopefully we can get some more cups. Ready so one of the warhawk females. Yeah, definitely. Let's go and sell some of them. Alright, nice. Hopefully, <laughs> this will work out for them. Um, do we got another pregnancy? Hopefully, uh, any male ones? No. Okay, perfect. Hello. No, that's a female. The female ones are more brown color. It's the male one, and the female one is the really old one who might actually die very soon. <laughs> might I say? Already has. <laughs> ah, perfect. Uh, it seems like uh, the female one is already dead, or did I not put it in the enclosure just yet? Ah, perfect. Yep. 
I do have the feeling that the um, the female uh, rhinoceros that we bought not too long ago is dead. Because I don't see it. So what we're going to do to at least maybe get um uh, let's get some more attraction and, and see as well the Indian elephant but I haven't seen yet, so let's get that. I'm just curious to see how it looks. I don't want, we'll put it back, but I just want to see how it all looks. I uh, must admit. So let's see how that one animal looks. So we lost the female rhinoceros that we bought a few seconds ago. That's definitely really annoying, I must admit. Um, so let's go and try and get the new rhinoceros. Mm. A 12 year old that is actually decent in fertility and 20, not too expensive as well, so that's perfect. Oh. Ooh, that's all well really interesting. Oh yeah, baby! Ah, oh, is she actually happy? She is, isn't she? Or he? They actually fine! She actually f oh, that's perfect! Oh, that's nice. That helps out with our rating. Look at that! Huh! Although the size might not be good anymore, but they're still fine with it, so that's perfect. Well, that's fixed that problem, so we could actually get maybe another female one, and then we should be fine. Only this African thing is still not good, so let's go and try and get maybe another female Indian elephant. Hopefully we can get that, that would not be bad, to be honest. Rewards, any rewards? No, unfortunate. Inbox animal. Okay then, that's not bad at all. We've got now an elephant. Oh, that looks so nice. You know that. That looks really good. The Indian elephant. Perfect. Oh, I really like the look of this one. Huh. Yeah, I definitely want some more social. Food enrichment, yeah, I've already removed that in like some of the animals enclosures, especially the, f the female ones. We got two in the trade center. Wait, we got this one still in the trade center? How did we do that? Uh, did we not sell it? Um, in that regard, I'm going to try and maybe do that. Alright, so let's go to zoo. Wait a second. Huh, that's weird. Oh, we got quite a lot of extra frogs. That's definitely interesting. I am pretty sure I sell that one already. But um, I might be able to get some extra points. Maybe. Yes! Oh! Well, so I'm, pretty, I'm pretty sure I sold that one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I sold that one. And I'm pretty sure I sold Tiger too. Uh, there weren't any yet. I can tell you that first. <laughs> oh, that is not bad. Uh, oh, uh, this one we also no longer have. But screw that. I will get it back in and then we'll have to see what we can do with it. Um, move to Trade Center again. Let's send them to Trade Center. Do we now cut here in an extra animal? Do we now? Do we got an extra rhino? No, we don't. Oh well. That was it was a try worth it, wasn't it? Like as I said, like eh. Well what I should do then if that they're like they're no longer in the trade center. Okay, they're, they're, they're still here. So if like animals if go to animal trading. Like they're not here. They're not in here. 
So what we're now going to do then, because they're still sort of in the zoo somehow. Um, already did sell them. Um, this one is in the trade center. Release into the wild. Did it work? I don't think it did, did it? No. Oh well. It was worth a try. It was worth a try. It was worth a try. No, we're the same with the, with the cat. No, 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 no. Here it is. Move to trade center. Well, that's unfortunate. It was worth a try. Uh, at least now we got an extra female. Hopefully we, they. Why? Why are you fighting? Er, like this is a bit of a bug. It seems like it. Hopefully that will work out. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, no! I just wanted to make a do. Uh, do it again. No. Uh, I want to make a screenshot of that. <laughs> uh, that was cool. Let's just try and get another animal in the trade center. Uh, let's go to Indian elephants again. Because they can fit into that enclosure, that's perfect. We might just build one at some point different one. But I'm thinking of making this... Um, maybe the last, um, last thing I want to go and do. Or at least the last episode of the series. We don't have enough food, or at least points for a good uh, female one, I think. Like, no one is going to buy those. That's not going to happen for those of you that put those ones in here. Like, no one is going to buy... Someone is going to buy this one, but I wouldn't do that because it's not good fidelity. Like, no one's going to buy these really expensive um, animals like this one. No one is going to buy a an two and a half thousand eight. Indian elephant that doesn't actually has some good fertility. It's bloody stupid if you would do that. Like, that's not really worth it. Yeah, their fat is already coming. Holy shit, look at that. <laughs> well, that's what you call a full up. And over here, you can also like, go down if you wanted to, so. Although over here they're mostly also for this one, and I possibly shouldn't have done that. <laughs> now I'm uh, looking at this, but well... Mistakes are to be made, hey? But now we at least got that, oh my god. Alright, now that's perfect. Uh -huh. Over here as well, we've got still quite a lot of those. Um, female. Male. Quite an old male. Again, female. 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 Male. These ones are quite easy with each other, although the habitat is possibly. The clean lives are not great. Alright, that's good to know, so. Why is it actually? It's because this. Why is not the habitat too good? Because the cleanness? That doesn't make sense because it's actually quite clean. I don't see any poop. To be honest, so. Hmm. Interesting. Maybe it is the size? No, oh, they're fine with that. Um, but uh, anyway, um, I think I'm going to leave it here, everybody. Uh, we've got some two three new avocados we see for the first time the West African line. Hmm. The West African line for the first time. Um, we also build an actually I think this is quite a nice enclosure. It's nothing special as I said. I'm going to do that 
when we're going to do a really sandbox mode, but I really want to play and play and really build a really cool enclosure, a new uh, like so. I would be really, what I would really like is I just save this and I'll scrap all of it and I'll build something new. That is something I would like to get, but I just, yeah, that's, it's going to be an absolute pain to do that. <laughs> But uh, we might do it or I might do it myself. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there. So again, thank you for watching. It was Heroes of the Greeks with... Um, um, yeah. Zoo, uh, Planet Zoo. And it was part 5. I think it might be the last one. Before the game comes out of full release. It depends a bit. I'm possibly going to remove those and then build something new. Just been testing out a bit with the buildings and all that kind of stuff. So, um, so it can be really good when the game comes out. Uh, but the channel will just be keep voting so not if something really special comes of course I will post it like uh, what I might do is the animals that we haven't seen yet like the grizzlies and all those types if I can get them I will um, make a separate video of them uh, or of something like that so I hope you all enjoyed it thank you for watching and I hope to see you in the next one